All right, it's early in the morning, November 30th, last day of November. I'm gonna fish the North Shore. Haven't been here in a little while. But the South Shore looked like it was really gonna start getting kicked up at least by noon today. And then like 10, 10 foot waves by uh, this evening. So I'll see what's going on here on the North Shore. I also bought a Sabiki rig. Try for herring too. Might be a little early for them, but could be some around. All right, now we'll try for herring. I don't have a flasher on it, but it's okay. Hook something, probably a foul hooked bunker. Actually, it almost looks like a shad from that. Oh yeah, it's a shad. Choke the swim shed. Nice. Good thing I had the light tackle here. Super light tackle. There we go. A little mini tarp in action. Let's see if I can swing them. I gotta be a little careful to set up so light, even with a shed. This guy's big. Might have to go beach him. Nice. Wow, that is a huge hickory shad. Zero. 21 inches if I pinch the tail. That is a big shad. There we go, hooked up again, another shed. This guy's a lot smaller, more of a normal size one. Still a lot of fun on this setup. the best release. All right, I'll try for a herring here. Hopefully I don't get shat on the sabiki because they destroy sabiki rigs, but this time of year, if there's shad, there's probably herring mixed in. Or bunker. That's the last thing I want to hook with the sabiki. Let's see, though, worth a try. All right, guys, well, I don't normally get excited about shad ever, but, um, hey, I guess a PR of any species is kind of cool. Um, and, yeah, especially as winter comes, you know, I'll take anything I can get that this time of year. So, anyway, guys, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed, please like and subscribe. Ring that bell for notifications on future content, and I'll see you all in the next video.